So as you walk into cabin number two over here on the left side, you have the coffee maker, toaster, all your mugs and stuff on the wall. You also have a little breakfast nook that you can pull out. It has two benches underneath it, so you have a place to eat. And then as you come along the left wall here, you also have bowls, dishes, pots and pans, nice big sink. There's silverware in the drawers. You have lighters and stuff. Utensils, anything that you would need for cooking is already here. It's got a full-size fridge and freezer. It's got a 50-inch TV. Nice microwave. You go up here to the little loft. You got a full-size mattress in the loft. Sheets and pillows and everything is already here, so you don't have to bring anything like that. Got a nice AC heater combo. Heats up the small area real nice. Nice couches. It also has that queen-size bed right there. And then we'll go outside. So out here you have a bunch of patio furniture. There's a little checkers. Well, not little, but it's a big checkers set that you can set out in the yard. Nice grill. Really nice view in the woods. The cabins are pretty far apart, so that's nice because you feel like you have your own space. In the summertime, this would be a really cool spot to hang out. They also have a fire pit down there. I don't think I showed. A little utility closet here with water heater and a Swiffer. Over here you have the bathroom. It's got a nice exhaust fan that turns on when you turn on the light. Pretty nice shower. The uh, shower head has really high pressure, so that was pretty nice. Lots of good pressure here on the faucet too. And this cabin sleeps six people. As far as bedding, towels, washcloths, shampoo, soap, all that stuff is already provided. They even provide coffee. But if you want creamer or sugar, you should probably bring that with you because they don't have it. There is a Dollar General about a mile away, so you can get pretty much anything you need. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next video.